This is calculator question number 32 from SAT test 1. College Board gives us a paragraph describing a truck transporting boxes over a bridge and they ask, what's the maximum number of boxes each weighing 14 pounds that a 4,500 pound truck can carry over a bridge that holds 6,000 pounds? Since this is a calculator question, I'm going to put y equals 6,000, my weight limit, into y1 and y equals 4,500, the weight of the truck, plus 14x, where x is the number of identical boxes, and each box weighs 14 pounds. So 14x is the weight of the bo boxes, and 4,500 is the weight of the driver plus the truck. For a window, I know if I have 100 boxes, that's 1,400 pounds, which is almost enough to take us over the weight limit. So I'm going to put my x max as 200, so I'm sure it will be in my window. And my Y max, since I need to see 6,000, I'm going to put 8,000 as my Y max. Hit graph. My graph looks something like this. I've got a constant here, and I've got a line, a positive slope, and I'll find the point of intersection. Second calc, arrow down to choice 5, intersect on the TI 83 or 84. Hit enter three times, and I get X equals 107 point whatever. If I round up to 108 boxes, which is mathematically wrong, that's also wrong for the words of the problem because my weight will be over 6,000 pounds. So I'll round down to 107 boxes, which makes sense. College Board often asks you to solve a linear equation in a word problem. So come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.